All right, guys. How you doing? Um, well, this was slightly unexpected. But basically, about three days ago, um, we were told that there's going to be an update for Battlefield 5. And get, and get this. They've actually added um, an anti-cheat to Battlefield 5. Uh, six years after release. Now, for a lot of people, I know that like uh, people like Jack... He's already been playing the game for, you know, he's been playing it pretty regularly for the last, I'd say, what, five years? And he hasn't had too many issues. The only thing is, is that when you stream the game, um, at least for me personally and for other, a few other people, I guess the anti-cheat's not enabled then. Um, <laughs> uh, when you stream the game and there's uh there's any cheers they'll follow you from game to game and literally not let you play the game essentially um so this is kind of like a big update for streaming because you literally couldn't play the game uh without basically getting cheated on just relentlessly uh if you noticed i haven't streamed battlefield 5 or even battlefield 1 in three years because it's just too it's too risky it's too just like frustrating to play because every time you go and stream it you just get a cheater following you around now i'm not saying allegedly allegedly um the anti-cheat is in the game and they're gonna turn it on at some point so um what's it called right now there's still a chance that people can mess around i think but they're literally gonna turn it on basically anytime soon to catch people out uh, but for streaming, especially like, it's, it's like BF1. Have you guys seen me do a BF1 stream in forever? I, I can't. I, oh, hello. I simply can't do a BF1 stream because, um, the game is just too full of cheers. And, and, and literally, I don't know many other games that have basically updated their anti-cheat years later just because people still play it. Because I think Battlefield 5 still has... How many? Battlefield 5 has like 50,000 daily players, which is actually absurd, to be honest. Most of the other games don't have that many. Bit lower, bit lower. Bit lower? Bit lower? Bit higher? I don't know. Where's that shot going? Sniping in this game is incredibly good. So I think it's actually my favorite. Um, it's my favorite sniping in any Battlefield game. So I keep thinking I'm going to attack sprint. Your main game. You still play it now. I've never done a BF5 stream on YouTube either. This is my first Battlefield 5 stream on YouTube. Never did one before. But it's cool to come back and play it. As I said, not 100% that everything's fixed. But still um, cool enough. I hit this guy in the head. Come on. Yeah. Oh, hang on, hang on. Someone's got a sniper. Can't see him. Oh yeah, you can lean. I forgot about that. I forgot about leaning. I'm still quite... Um, I'm quite... Oh, I need to turn the volume up a little bit. I'm still relearning the ropes of BF5. Although that first headshot was absolutely nuts. Can I get this guy's head? Beautiful. On Steam alone, too? Yeah, I forgot about that. I'm not even on Steam. This was like my... Uh, I think this was my favorite sniper. I'm not sure. You play BF5 every Friday night. Well, there you go. Did I like BF1 sniping? Weirdly, I actually thought it was... Um, I know it sounds silly. But I thought it was It was a little bit too handholdy, wasn't it, BF1? Like, it was great. I had a great time, but... Completely overpowered. It meant that anyone anyone could shoot you anywhere and still get a one shot and it made it a bit like trivial, you know? Like don't get me wrong, it was still it was still great. I still loved it. Because you know, if you could hit your shots, then GG. But um You know. Ooh, damn, that was instant though. So yeah, basically, um, they finally updated the game to have an anti-cheat six years later, which is 
insane. Who would who'd have thought? Genuinely, who'd have thought? I, what other game has done that? What other game has done this? Oh god, the, the game's still a bit like... I'm still like trying to switch weapons. I guess I've been playing too much Warzone. I'm like switching weapons quickly and it just feels weird. It doesn't like me like switching weapons too quickly. But it goes... Ugh, ugh, ugh. I can't even tell what weapon I got out. Mm. That's a tank. And we're instantly dead to a tank from behind cover. This is the battlefield way. Nice. Why did I die to that? So stupid. Is he just randomly firing? Jungle carbine? I'll use the jungle carbine later. Okay, I've only seen vehicles so far. There's a dude. What's my... Ah, it's C. C is my spotting key and I've, I've forgotten how to... Why did I change it to C? Is it because I... I, I bet you I changed it to C because of Warzone as well. Maybe I should um, set my, what's it called, to toggle, my lean. I'm not used to... I don't know, maybe. I've got I've got leaning on toggle, and I don't know if it's the right thing to do. What do most people do? Hey, Westy, you gonna join me on some BO5? Yeah. Look at that, look at that, dude. You literally can't do that on Warzone anymore, I'm not kidding. Because they've because of how shaky the aim is on Warzone now. That guy. Because of how shaky the aim is on Warzone now, you can't be that precise that quickly. You've gotta like really take it slow with the long range shots. Where are these guys? I'm gonna get one D to our vehicle in a second. Wait, I can't remember if it's it is this one that you shoot in the air. Because BF1 you can shoot in the floor. Do I play? I play ADSF. Yeah, yeah. I play ADS, ADS FOV off on long range maps because you get the extra zoom. Why does that vehicle look destroyed? What? It's like if it, it was destroyed until I scoped in. Maybe I've got some weird setting on. It does look really good. Oh, where'd he go? He's dead. The enemy team is kind of giving up now. You can lean while holding F. Oh yeah, you can kind of dodge shots as well with lean as well, if I remember correctly. Nice. Hip fire is still insanely strong. Glad to see. Oh yeah, the worst thing about Battlefield was the uh, attrition, wasn't it? The fact you didn't feel to full health if you just didn't have a, a healing thing. It was such a... Whoa. It was such a weird decision. Who, who balances these games, dude? <laughs> what is it? Oh, why? Why is it like this? This guy's got how many kills? 49 kills. And he's just shooting randomly into a square. It's any of these artillery things. That's what always... Uh, Piss me off. But it is just like real life. Random. Chaotic. Now that's what I call Battlefield. Thank you for the 102 months, dude. Is it pronounced the D? Yeah, I think so, dude. Yeah, something like that. Dude, the bullet velocity on these guns is crazy. I think this is like, what, 800, 900 meters a second? Which is pretty crazy. I hit him in the boat. Let's see. Come on, get him in the boat. Get him in the boat. Need to reload. One, two, three. Where'd he go? He's dead. The enemy team is having a bit of a rough time, I will be honest. I don't know how how far they're going to make it. 
I guess that's why you need uh, vehicles that just one frame you from across the map. I get a kind of. Do you think AI can balance games better than people? But the thing with AI, if you told an AI to balance a gun, it would perfectly balance it mathematically. And I don't know if that's fun. There seems to be some variance, you know, if it's going to be fun. Otherwise, every gun will just feel the same in, in different ways. The problem I have is when a gun... I, I think an AI could definitely warn a dev if a gun is too overpowered based on the fire rate and the damage. You know, you could use the AI to give you like... Um, oh, I'm using throwing knives. I, I think you could use AI to give you like a, a warning system as opposed to just saying like, uh, oh, this is... You know, let's make all the guns function the same. You know what I mean? Whoa, how did I not get that heady? Yeah, I definitely think maybe um, when they when they balance guns, they should run it through a uh, an AI and say, "Hey, is this gun completely broken? Have I given it the? Have I made it too strong? That might help." But I don't think you should get AI to balance them completely. Do you remember the collateral I got in BF five in the boat? Yeah, I remember, I remember that. Yeah. Would much rather watch you play this than 2042. Well, I mean, 2042 was fun for a, for a couple of days. A day. Dice ignored 100 playtesters that were paid to give feedback. Well, what if I told you that... Uh, I, as far as I know, I've never been paid to give feedback. So, you know, I'm pretty sure I've only ever done feedback for free. So imagine how I feel. Boy, boy didn't even get paid. I know that uh, a lot of people have seen that uh, Shroud clip. I am surprised that he did talk about it publicly because I'm pretty sure a lot of that stuff is under NDA. So, a bit mad. But I guess, you know, W Shroud for just being honest. You know? But the experience has always been you give your feedback and you hope that they put in like one... One in every ten things you say. You, do you know what's funny? I, I've talked about this before. The only time is when I give feedback through a video. Not through the, the feedback channels where I've been told, hey, can you come in and give us some feedback? You know what I mean? Like, I, it's only ever happened because I've made a video and complained about something. That was a, I thought, I thought it was a headshot. Go on, have a peek. Go on, go on have a peek. Go on, 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 have a peek. What? I swear I hit that. Um, what did Shroud say? Basically, Shroud was talking about um, he did a feedback session. This is all public knowledge. This isn't like um, hidden from anyone. If you go and watch, like Shroud basically said, they paid about a hundred creators, not including me, a hundred creators to give feedback on Battlefield 2042. Uh, and then he said that they didn't listen to a single word that they said. Uh, and he said, not even, not even one. Uh, so there you go. Um, so yeah, so that's basically what the big news was, is that, um, yeah, Shroud was one of the people that got paid. And he's like, yeah, I got paid, but they didn't listen to a word I said. And I think he's more annoyed about the fact that he gave feedback and they, they did nothing about it as opposed to... Uh, as opposed to... Think, I, I think there is, a, there is a little bit of a divide, right? I've always thought about the fact that if you're a developer, do you really respect uh, the creators a lot of the time? You know? I wonder if it's kind of a thing of like, look... I make the games, you just play them. Yeah, nice feedback, bro. You know, like, that, that's, that's, you know, I hope that's not how it is, but that's, like, somehow... It, it, feel, it feels like maybe they're just like, yeah, okay. Okay, bro, yeah, cool, yeah, no, nice thoughts. You know, and then they just go, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my own thing. And 
that's why Shroud's making a game now? Well, that's what I mean. I think, I think um, with content creators making games, it'll be a true testament to be, well, you know, it, it, people have always said, dude, streamers actually know what they're talking about because they seem to just kind of be self-serving. Um... No, I don't think Shroud cares about the money either. He doesn't need it. Um, yeah, I think I think some sometimes it just feels like some people will purposefully just be like, "Okay, I'll take your feedback, but I'm I'm just uh, you know that's cool and all, but this is my product, not yours." You know, like thanks for the feedback, but at the end of the day. You know, maybe you can give us feedback on what color the uh, the shirt should be. I mean, the problem is I shouldn't push food too far forward because there's no need to. You know, if I if I was invited to tell my opinion, would I tell them to remove specialists? Moving away from the class system was not not wise, and I think anyone could point that out pretty quickly. I think the re the reason why they did the the reason why they did the specialist is because the popularity of class based shooters or sorry hero based shooters was popular. That's literally it. They did it based off data. They're like, look at look at X and Y game popular because of because of heroes. Ah, insane. You know, look at look at this game. Look at that game. Why are they popular? Oh, they have heroes. Valorant, Apex. Actually, I think Valorant came out. At the same time, but Apex. Oh, I missed it. I'm almost the heady. Almost had the heady. They still have 400 tickets. I don't think it, this game's never going to end, even if they don't push. And maybe I should, uh, maybe I should find a new server. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Because otherwise we're just going to be sitting here for a while, just on the edge, just edging. Whoa, they got blown up. Hello? Do I find a new server? I don't know. I think 2042 is in a much better state now. Yeah, but they're not changing the fundamentals anyway. I get, I get that. They're not, they're not going to change the fundamentals now, that's for sure. Um, but, yeah. At least it runs nicely. That's one thing I'll say. Battlefield 2042 runs like a dream. If you have a decent PC. I don't want it's like on low end. Okay. Is that ours or that? I actually don't know if that's ours. I think that's ours. We are now losing We're losing, eh? Oh, shit. You found cheaters in DMZ? Yeah, I'm not surprised. <laughs> yeah, sounds about right. Okay. That's a big explosion. There was people literally where I was looking, but I don't know where they went. They're apparently right in front of me. I can't see them. I can't see them. There he is. It's not about the developers, it's about the product owners. Well, I guess. It's about who makes the decisions about how the game is actually going to look, etc. Because I think a lot of the changes that um, people usually give are probably like big sweeping changes that are probably harder to do when the game is basically already ready to release, right? They usually get feedback in way too late. Every single time. The last time I gave feedback, the game was going to release in three months. And that wasn't 2042, by the way. It might have been a game that we're playing right now. 
um, yeah, so I got to give feedback once the game had already basically been made and it was just being like, what's it called? It was being uh, fixed or It was being um, polished, so to speak. And that's the problem. If they do it too late, it's too late. And then it's over. Is this, I don't think this game is ever going to end. I need to get used to the bullet velocities again. Is Battlefield 5 good now? Uh, Battlefield 5 is pretty much the same. It's just that there's going to be less cheaters now. Supposedly. Um, the reason why I stopped streaming Battlefield 5 and Battlefield 1 is because the cheating became unbearable. Um, especially for streamers, because the, the people would target the streamers, basically. Ooh, I need to hit better shots, brother. So yeah, it just, it just became basically unplayable, so I, I just gave up. Oh, I hit him for the head, dude, but this... Buy my keybinds for leans. Q and E. Do, 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 do. This game still looks pretty nice. Do you think this game looks nicer than 2042? You reckon? I think the problem with this um, this enemy team is they have they have too many um, tank players who are using basically just artillery tanks, so none of the tanks are actually pushing, which is always a problem I've had with these games. Because you give the people options to just sit in the spawn and with a sniper or a tank. Especially a tank like the artillery tanks. And they don't have to push. And there's no, there's no, um, there's no, what's it called? There's no uh, counter or benefit to it. They just get loads of kills and then they leave your team to just sit there and die, you know? So there's just, there's this, oh, there you go. We've got a tank pushing up. So we have two tanks using the Caliente or whatever it is. And they're just sitting in the spawn where they can't be shot in positions that no one can get to. Um, and now they're just going to stay there for the rest of the game. Just getting, what, like uh, 55 kills, 40, oh, 55 kills, 44 kills, uh, 52 kills, I think. At least our teammates' planes are actually going for the enemy, the enemy plane, look. Ooh, that was a really nice shot. This game needs a what, like 2042? This game, no, dude, the slide in this game is insane, dude. Do you, do you know? The slide in this game is crazier than 2042. You've not seen it. Okay, so in this game, like a bit like a bit like MW3, right? I can do a slide where I do a circle on the floor. You can't do that in Call of Duty. You can do a circle on the floor and uh, dodge people's bullets. You can you can slide left. You can slide backwards. Ready? It's it, the the slide in this game is actually insane. Uh, anyway, right. We'll stay here for another twenty tickets, and then I gotta go find a new server because this one's this one's just too. What's it called? We're just gonna stay here. It is fun though. I don't don't get me wrong. I'm having great fun just sniping people in the head occasionally, but it's not very active. Why can't you slide with the same clamshell key? You can. You just have to double tap it. You double tap. Um, you double tap crouch, and it slides instead. All right. Next death. I'm out. The magic slide. Yeah. Look at that thing. Look. What is that? What is that? The giant bomb. Oh, and this game doesn't have a mirror mats either, which is nice. Oh, I almost got a collat then. Uh, anyone else? How'd I miss? What the heck? How am I missing? What the hell? 2042 movement is bad. 2042 movement is visually like not. It doesn't look good. It doesn't look real. Like I know you. I know we're saying realism, but it doesn't look authentic at all. Battlefield, Battlefield 2042 movement is like 
you just kind of skip along the ground like crazy. And at least in this game, it looks relatively plausible. You know? I don't know. Is movement in BF5 better than uh, 2042? You'd have to tell me. All right. All right, let's find a new server. How's the anti-cheat? Well, there's no, no cheaters so far, but I mean, I don't know, man. But well, I guess we'll see. Okay, I should have got a new server. We hope. Yeah, so the reason why I've never streamed Battlefield 1 or Battlefield 5 in a long time is because the cheating so bad. Now, the weird thing is, is that they've applied the anti-cheat update to BF5, but not Battlefield 1. Um, Battlefield 1 has an even bigger cheater problem because it's been out longer. So the cheats are just obviously more developed, I guess. Um, so yeah, the cheats in BF1 are pretty rough. Uh, like, my, my favorite thing about BF1 is the... Ch oh, okay. I, I I I lost connection. It didn't let me join that server weirdly. No, maybe I'll I'll see I'll join again. Um. So yeah, they added they added uh the anti cheat to BF five, but not to BF one, which is very interesting. Did I lose connection. No, I'm in. Okay, I don't know what happened there. We're in. You're in. What should I use? M95, Lee Enfield. Let's use the uh, Lee Enfield. Actually, I didn't. I didn't really want to spawn on that. It's only me and one other guy. He's on the other side. He's behind this. Literally, he's behind this. Can I shoot him through already? You can. You okay? So if you didn't know, in Battlefield Five, the um, mini map is so accurate. You can actually use your own, you know, you see the little thing on the minimap on the bottom left. You see the, the little, the torch light. If you line the torch light up with an enemy through a wall, you can shoot them through the wall. It's actually completely broken. Now, the end field is a bit slower, but so, so much easier to fire just multiple shots in a row. Uh, I need to be faster, man. I'm slow. I'm actually slow, dude. I'm not keeping up anymore. One thing I like about BF5 as well is I can read the chat whilst I'm playing. Which is nice. Like riding a bike. Eddie. Yeah, dude. Three. Big slow, a bit slow on the heady there. I think my frame rate's improved since the last time I played as well. Still got it for now. I've still got it ish, you know? I reckon there's some absolute demons on this game. Especially if they're cheating. Bloody hell. This gun is so insane. I forgot how good it was. He's not gonna peek there, is he? Ah, that's my bad. He's dead. I wish the scope was a cross, not a T-post. I really wish they gave you options to like choose the scopes you want to use, you know? That would be nice. I am a bit slower, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, where did I go? I've got one here. This guy seems to know what's up, brother. Whoa. Yeah, the problem is, is... Oh, it does It does feel smooth, though. I will say. Warzone doesn't feel as smooth as this. For sure. Oh. I get disconnected. I wonder if it's the admin messing with me or something. I don't know. Hmm. 
is weird. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Come on, game. Let me in. Oh, all right. Well, I'll look for my server then. Ooh, this one should be fun. Do, 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 do. Now this, if I keep getting disconnected, I'll just see what's going on. Um, bolt action. Where's the jungle carbine? Oh, you need to go medic, don't you? <laughs> I forgot about this. I forgot you can't um, switch weapons. You can switch weapons and slide. You can't switch weapons and sprint for some reason. I think it slows you down. Yeah. So it feels like anyway. How's the audio? Do I need to turn up the audio? Can you guys hear the game okay? By the way, how quick is it to get into servers, dude? This is in, this is unheard of. In 2042, I'm like, literally, I get kicked from a server and I'm just like, yep, straight back in. Two seconds. Five seconds, maybe. Worst map, this one. Well, this man, this one's pretty good for snipers. I don't mind this one for snipers. Seems like everyone knows the strats of just not peeking, though. Turn the, I'll turn the volume up a little bit. Hmm. Oh, yeah, they know, they know, they know. No one wants to peek each other, look. They're all just holding angles. I forgot the uh, TTK in this. Instantly. Oh, we're on another server with 1,100 tickets. Okay. That will never end. What about TAA always being on in this game? I mean, that's, I'm not bothered. The enemy is taking objective which is which sniping is better, 2042 or 5? I think 5 takes a... I don't know. 5 probably takes a little bit more skill. 2042 has these, like, insta-beam weapons that you, like... I feel like people just play this 24-7. I've not seen many people. I think because this has so many tickets, the enemy team just doesn't really care about pushing. So it's just whatever. But then again, if you've got loads of snipers, why would you move? You know? An enemy? No. Teammate. Is he on in? Okay. Of course there's a the guy there. Did DICE update BF5 for new content? Will they still update BF5 for new content? Oh, God, no. They've just made it more uh, playable now. Essentially. That's it. They've made the game actually playable. They've allowed us to stream it, at least. Mm -hmm. Um... Okay, this guy's this guy's ruining the vibe. Okay, I'm pulling back. Maybe I should use grenades instead of throwing knives because I barely use the throwing knives. They should have low health. Three body shots, dude? How do I give them... 
Wait, you can team kill in this game? Uh, is this hardcore? I tried to, I tried to, I thought I was like giving them a health kit. The heck? Is this hardcore? I'm on hardcore. Right, that's why everything's a one shot. Oh my god. I was like, I was like, huh? Why the hell do you just die one shot? So I could just aim for body shots then. This is gonna be broken as hell. This sniper's completely broken. No mini map? Oh, dude, I didn't even notice. I've not been using my mini map. Dude, so medic's gonna be completely insane then. I'm going for I'm going for headshots. So I don't need to. I tried pressing three on the guy that was low on health though, and it didn't do anything. I'm kind of oh. Do I have I have this? Hold on. I've never actually played hardcore. But I feel like if it's a one shot body shot with the jungle carbine, I mean GG then. How is there people behind me? Was that teammate? It was, isn't it? Oh uh, yeah, I feel like I, that's why, because I'll get team killed. When I. Oh, for goodness. I got. Oh, you stupid. Let me just walk in front of the door for five seconds! Oh yeah, guys, remember we were supposed to get the dragging uh, mechanic. Do you think that would have helped the game a lot? With its with its fast TTK, before, even without hardcore. Also, I'm pretty sure I didn't hit that person. They just, it's like kind of, they lagged into me. Well, no, like the, dra honestly, the, the I think I said this in a video about BF5. Like, some of the mechanics in BF5 are so long-winded and awful, and they never changed them, but they were supposed to- we were supposed to have the dragging mechanic to make them not shite. Yep, definitely heard those guys on my left, right next to me. Let's go, baby. Did anti-cheat actually help? No, I'm still cheating, passenger. So, it didn't work. Um... The dragging, no, so here's the thing, right? I always talked about the fact that the um, the revive mechanic on BF5 is abhorrent. And that's the only word I can use to describe it. Um, and they never, and they're just like, nah, we're going to keep it exactly the same. No, you stupid. Stop running into the middle when there's like 600 people aiming that way, obviously. Nice. Yeah, these guys are stupid. Using B? I've not seen anyone. That's the problem with this this game mode. I need to know the spots where they're going to be hiding. I'm surprised they even pushed up, to be honest. I don't even know how they did it. Is there not? I almost shot my teammate. That was close. Dude, this is this is broken. I forgot about this. I forgot how OP the jungle carbine is, and I've never used it on um I've never used it on hardcore before. Insane. Yeah. I thought it would, I thought the mine was gonna kill him. Why is no one resing? Do we not have any medics over here? Why is no one playing medic? Dude, this is broken. What the heck? I'm actually cheating. The heck? Dude, isn't it? I, I, I'll tell you what's nice. Coming back to a game where the aim is where your crosshair is from Warzone. 
where it isn't. Your aim is where your crosshair isn't in Warzone right now. Huh? Oh, I got team killed. Sick, dude. I did play. I No, no. I've played Hell Let Loose. I'll tell you here. Here's exactly what happened when I played Hell Let Loose. You ready? I spawned in. Ran for 30 minutes. Died eight times. And quit the game forever. I didn't see a single player. And I died four times or eight times in 30 minutes. Ridiculous. And then one time, I think the last time I played it, like a couple of years before that, I got like 50 kills without being seen. And it's just like, that's not for me. At all. Like, I want there to be me. Like, I want there to be some skill involved in, in spotting and reacting to people as opposed to just being behind a tree or in a vehicle or whatever. Oof. You weren't playing it correctly. No, I'm not playing it at all, Monty Mar. I'm never playing it again. And maybe that's that's what I'm saying. Yeah, maybe I'm not playing it correctly, but I'm certainly not playing it again. Oh my god, dude. Pain. Well, pain for that guy, mainly. Yeah. And now I'm in the open so they can shoot me. This game is so... I, the revive is busted, dude. I don't know what they were thinking. Wait, I can heal him from there? It's crazy. I'm a bit slow on these shots. This is crazy. What's the problem with the revive? It's a fixed animation that you that you are not in control of where you're seen. You know what I mean? It's an animation that locks you into an angle, and so. And so you often, um, so if I heal this guy now, I want to heal him facing this wall. But what will happen is my character's ass will stick out to the left and then I die. Need to reload. We'll be dead though, I don't know. It's definitely a bumper. We come around the corner, right? Well, a little bit. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous, dude. No way. Arco's crazy. But you can cancel the revive. Oh, that's fixed, bro. Yeah, dude. You can cancel the revive. Dude, how could I forget? Y you know in war, you know what they did? Sometimes they would cancel the revive too. I mean, to be fair, they wouldn't even revive. Let's be honest. There was no, there was no magic. Uh, there was no magic injector that brought you back from, the, from life. But no, like seriously, the whole the whole like and a revival animation was dumb, and I and it makes me mad that they never did anything about it. Especially when they weren't gonna have the um, revive uh, the dragging mechanic. That's what annoyed me. I've been dabbling BF1 and BF5 recently, and I noticed less cheats in BF5. Well, this is this is why. Have you noticed, guys? I like BF1. I like playing BF5. Occasionally, I don't like playing them like too often, but I literally couldn't play them because there's um, there was too many cheaters, uh, and then cheaters that would target streamers, and then nothing would happen to them. So, 
I just, I guess, guess, guess I'll die. Was the meme? It was just, uh, yeah, I guess I'll just, I'll just die then. Because uh, no one's gonna help. Need your beak. Oh, it's not a one shot. Yes, a collab. Let's go. This is broken, but... Let's go. That was nice. Do my bullets go where I'm aiming? That's insane. I've never had this before. My bullets actually go where I'm aiming. What the heck? When am I going to get kicked for team killing, though? I'm pretty sure that's going to happen pretty soon. Maybe I ha is there a they've bu they've got a built-in karma system. I don't know. Is anyone gonna res those guys? I could try. Remember, people can come up onto that window very easily. Can you imagine they add anti-cheat to BF4? Uh, maybe. That'd be crazy. BF4 has its own problems, though. They're not related to cheaters, unfortunately. Dude, who looked at the jungle carbine and was like, yeah, this gun's balanced. Where'd that go? I didn't even see where that went. Yo, I'm allowed to have fun in the video game? Oh, did you guys see the rebirth stream yesterday? Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. If you didn't. How did he get up here with no one seeing him? That's a one shot? There's no way. Have I played Rust and what do I think about it? First time I played Rust, I got stream sniped on a random server and killed five times in a row and then I quit. I think they were cheating too. Yeah, it was it was not a great experience because I think it was when it was at the time when there wasn't that many people streaming rust either So I started playing it and then these guys like they just followed us and ruined our fun Who knows maybe I could have been a uh, I could have been a rust streamer Although doesn't rust have the same recoil system as like CS Is that gonna hit my teammate? Please don't hit my teammate Thanks, bro Actually, what's the score? Has, has the... Has the health and squads thing always been there? Oh, it is, because that's where the map... That's where the map usually is, isn't it? Of course. Oh, that was close. I shot the grenade midair and it blew up. Nair bursted. So now, you see, I'm going to be smart. I'm not running in front of my teammate who's got an LMG. What do you think? That's smart. I'm not going to walk in front of him so he, like, ruins me and team kills me by accident.
Okay. That's enough smoke, I think. Can I kill people with direct hitting the smoke, do you think? I'm dead. Surely I'm dead. Surely I'm dead. Surely I'm dead. There's a guy running across. How do I not die then? Didn't Ravik get banned from official BF4? I don't think it would be official. Otherwise, he'd be banned from the whole game. He would get ba He could get banned by a mod, though. That, or an admin. That happens all the time. I'm banned. I'm pretty. I think I'm banned from a lot of BF4 servers because they don't allow streamers, let alone cheers. You're just not allowed to stream on the servers because it attracts too much attention. Smoke direct here is ten, but what what about on uh, hardcore? Maybe it's more on hardcore. Maybe it's a one shot. I think we've got them locked down. Nice. Team. Not only did he kill me, he was trying to shoot at our own teammate. <laughs> Brother. Oh, it's five damage. Okay. Okay, bro's got his angle. My brain, my reactions have to be fast here. Ooh, that was close. Almost died in two shots. He's gonna run out though. Teammate should have him. Teammate's got my angle. Interesting strat. You know what's crazy about Battlefield as well compared to Call of Duty? People miss shots in Battlefield. <laughs> you know? What well, I don't know what it is about Warzone, but I don't think anyone ever misses a shot anymore. Should have died there, probably. You can play Firestorm. Yeah, I'm not going to play Firestorm today, though. Not today. I love this. He is on fire, though. Yikes. Going for the risk. No, he was in the corner. He's right there, dude. God damn it. I didn't think he had an angle. That was annoying. dead yeah i had to hit two shots i thought maybe it was still a one shot that range but it wasn't i was at, I, unfortunately i was actually a call of duty player before i was a battlefield player because i went uh modern warfare 2 on pc then i went to bf3 for like a couple of hundred hours and then i played the shite out of battlefield 4 that's how i got into battlefield in reality in one month, is going to be your 10 years of following. Nice. He, there is a guy in there, but I've... Oh, boy. No, no, no. Why is there a guy there? I bet you he's just prone. I bet you're just sitting prone behind a wall. Where is he? I don't see him. Oh, he's there. No? Where is he? I have no idea.
The problem is we don't have anyone looking. I don't know where they are. They were behind me though. Is that them? No, that's not them. Where is this guy that shot me in the back? They, they actually pushed us back. That's what's crazy. I was not expecting it. I still don't know the angles very well. And yes, there is. And yes, they didn't get him. God damn it, dude. What did I stream first? Battlefield 4. Yeah, I streamed Battlefield 4 because the sniping was insanely good on BF4. It was quite hard, though. This game looks more intimate. Now, this game just looks more fun, dude. Squad suppression is this. I missed, damn it. Can't really get a good angle. I'm trying not to shoot my teammates as well. That's the hardest part. And trying to not get my teammates to shoot me. enough smokes everyone are we done with the smokes yet I've just realized if I look I can actually see the highlight through this so if someone crosses over it if someone crosses over the highlight of the the ammo I can just shoot them I think I'm gonna get shot in the back by a teammate what are you doing dude what, are, what the hell man what a moron what are you doing I was like uh That's insane. Obviously. No, oh, this guy's like just team killing? What are you doing, bro? He's joined the game just to team kill and now he's been kicked. What are you doing? What a what a moron. What are you doing? Good job, I guess. That's usually why I didn't play um, hardcore back in the day. I was rank one sniper in BF4. I was for a day, I believe. I was I was rank one in the world for one day, and then mugs um, overtook me in that one day. Oh, this is crazy. This angle. I was number one in the UK though for a long time. Oh, this is disgusting. Like, is this is the campaign, dude. This is the campaign mission. I should probably lean as well, right? So I just have, like, the least amount of my character showing. Oh, I didn't hear that. By score or how? By kills. I think it was like a hundred and a hundred and thirty-seven thousand kills or something with the sniper for number one. Since when you're a camper? Since this is Battlefield, bro? What are you talking about? And I'm using a sniper rifle on hardcore. Shut up. Well, no, I'm only playing hardcore because for some reason I kept on getting kicked from the other server. But I'm having fun, so. Ooh. Oh, 
Poor guy. Where is he? Yeah, we, we don't slide cancel in Battlefield, but you can actually slide quite well, actually. Also, since when have I not been a camper, really? If, I'm, if, I, if we're being truthful, though. A guy? That is a guy, but I don't think I can hit him. Look, he just, he's, he's outlined there. Ooh, yeah, I'm being sniped at. This is kind of what Grey Zone is going to be like. I need to get. I need to not kill my teammates. Difficulty 11, level a million. Don't misunderstand me, I'm a huge fan. Yeah, dude, we're playing hardcore sniping. Uh, if I, I. One bullet is. One bullet kills. So, no, we have to sit in a room and shoot people and net kills as a sniper. That's why we're camping, I guess. We're just waiting until the next Battlefield game. Team! How did he see me and I couldn't see him? Oh, yeah, you can't skip with space. I got a nade? Holy crap, that was insane. Just threw it to the left. Wow. Mm. Camping in Battlefield is very normal, especially when I'm on defense, bro. Come on, give me a break. If I've had so much potential, well, what? I don't know. I feel like the game just needed a less of a hardcore vibe. I had a theory about BF5's development, and I always thought it was because um, they did it because they want. The, uh, genuinely, I think this is one of the reasons they saw PUBG. And they wanted people to play a Battlefield game like PUBG. That's why the healing is the way that it is. You know? Oh, come on. So the, the healing is kind of like slow and doesn't like fully refresh because they were like, oh, we want people to play it like you play PUBG where you have to like revive your teammate slowly and you have to like be tactical with it. You know, you can't just run in the open. Oh, we don't know. Because this game, this game came out Right after PUBG, if I remember correctly. The, the, the speed up. And Battlefield 2042 wanted to hear a shooter. Yeah. Am I talking about the anti-cheat update? Heck yeah, dude. I don't want to shoot my teammate by accident. Dude, these windows are lethal. Chasing trends instead of setting them. I mean, that's I mean, I can't confirm that. That's purely the the word on the street. Are these guys are gonna run out here because I need a shot. There's someone in here. He was on the left side of that door. And I've not seen him since, so we're gonna leave him. Oh, jeez. 
Danke okay, für das Res. Ganz ruhig, das wird schon wieder. Can I come through the window here? I can't remember. We are now losing objective Anton. Mm. Ich werfe eine Bombe. 72. Don't shoot me. This is the problem with the smokes. My teammates are going to shoot me in the end. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be my teammate done doing that. We're going to be killed. I know it. This is a nice little angle to hold as long as I'm getting shot from the right. Okay, I think we're okay for now. Teammates are dying. I have time to res, I need to hold this. Don't shoot teammates, dude! Come on! Why is their teammate and an enemy standing right next to each other? That's such classic behavior. Okay, they must have a, like, a, a rat nest somewhere. Where the hell are they? There's so many of us on this point, so they have to have like tons of them just standing around somewhere. This is a really, the reason why I don't want to move from here, because this is a disgusting spot if they run through this hallway. Absolutely gross. No, oh, sorry. That's the one. That's why it's good to play a medic, because I can just revive them, even if I team kill them by accident. Damn, that was unlucky. Unlucky. I mean, I think they'll. I think they'll definitely win. The enemy team. They got a lot of tickets. Ah, oh, bro is bro is spawn spawn to see that this is camping, dude. That's not helping. I'm at least going for the objectives or trying to hold them. I might get shot here because I'm probably not low enough to the ground. Oh no 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 no! We can't. We literally can't res that. Impossible. If I could drag them, I would, but I can't because the game doesn't add that. Let me get a heady. Hold on. There's such long angles here. It's like disgusting for hardcore. I just need to not shoot teammates. Difficulty impossible. There must be so many somewhere. I need someone to just watch my left and I'm good. Okay, well he just died literally from this angle. Okay. That's, that's, and that's COD timing, dude. The game made a comeback? Brother, this game has 50,000 daily players. That's insane. It has more than 2042, I think? Or does 2042 have more now? I don't know. GG. That was a fun round, though. Smash the like button. Well, I'll tell you what. If we hit a thousand likes, I'll do uh, I'll do weekly Battlefield streams. But I doubt that's going to happen. <laughs> and also, we don't even know if the anti cheats actually working yet.
Pacific Storm Conquest. No, thank you. That was fun. Even as hardcore. Oof. Hamada. Brother, ooh. What's that? Can I join this? But the thing is, I'm still going to sit back and snipe people. I'm not going to run out there. Battle bit has a drag feature. Yeah, but it is scuffed. Like, if you look at Battle Bit's dragging feature, like, it's on, it's, it's scuffed on purpose. Like, it's fine, but it is scuffed. Like, let's, let's not, let's be real here. <sighs> Thank you. Polygon had a big update. I remember Polygon. It was fun. Are there stream snipers? Sometimes. Not, not, not right now. I can usually tell when people are stream sniping because I've... Well, I mean, that's literally all I do is complain about stream snipers. But they do make it quite obvious. Usually. I think um, the, guy that, the, di the guy that was team killing me literally had two kills, had just joined the game, and... Team killed me twice and then got kicked anyway. I think he was stream sniping. See, that's the problem with not playing hardcore. It's actually a lot. It's actually harder to snipe. It's harder to snipe um, on normal core. What is that? I think I'm being spotted right now. Because if you don't hit a heady, that's it. If you don't hit the headshot in normal core, they're pretty much going to survive and heal before you can get the second shot off. GG, I guess. You might re-peak on full health, though. Three, two, one, re-peak. Full health. You see what I mean? So I have to hit the headshots or I'm deed. I could probably go jungle carbine ago, uh, again, though, for this map, and I probably should. If I actually want to get kills. That guy... Aim for the head then. Thanks, bro. That's so that's that's pretty high IQ. Oh, he tried to prone me, didn't. I forgot you can't ADS and shoot. than 2042 where they can hide till 100 HP? Um, I mean, I guess. Bro is running. What mode is this? Breakthrough. My favorite mode. From any battlefield game because it was just like rush but more refined okay whatever that thing is just shooting me in the face and i can't see okay let's see if i can get him first shot headshot if i get the height the height right get higher way higher oh my god way higher oh my god it's, it's actually ridiculously high breakthrough was the best yeah I don't know where my bullets are going. Actually, way lower, I think. I have to aim to the sky, basically. 
Uh, enemy hit 33. They must run through my mine. How far do I need to... Okay, it's not that... Okay, it's not as low as I thought, actually. It's actually not as low as I thought. But... Okay, so about a centimeter and a half for that boat, if they peak again. Is there the other boat as well? There is a guy, look. Oh my god, it's way more. Okay, it's like that. It's like that. God knows how I'm going to get him. The fact you can um, stay scoped in with the jungle car one as well is crazy. Um, am I? Right, is it bad that I actually think the normal comma rows on this game is maybe slightly better? Um, there's a tank. Are there any guys on there? Way, I am low, dude. So low. I've been very I've been on defense almost every single round. I didn't even think about it. That guy's still in the little hatch there. Let's go find him. I'm still sad we didn't get Stalling Rad. Did they stop support for Battlefield 5 for 2042, right? Oh, I maybe yeah, that's a double frag grenade. Mm-hmm. I can't really get in a good position to actually see anyone. We could push up a little, you know. I'm not against it. The problem is there's no cover. There's no cover here. And we're about to get shot by these guys coming across. That guy's head. That guy's head. It was, but I could barely see him. Enemies? Where are they at? Oh! That was nice. I think I'm in the open now. <sighs> Am I playing on DX12? No, I'm playing on DX11. Although, I tell you what, when I started this game up this morning, I don't know if people still have this, it starts in HDR mode and completely screws your computer until you restart it. Um, I don't know if anyone... Like, I, I, I thought they'd fixed this years ago. But basically, the game starts up in HDR every single time. Woo! Yeah, I'm glad you guys are liking the, uh, the Battlefield stuff. Very occasionally. Turn it off in Windows. I don't even know. Does that work? No, but what I'm saying is, is that I guarantee you a lot of people are playing this game in HDR and they don't even know how to turn it off. It, it's, and it, by the way, it lags your game, makes the game almost unplayable and doesn't look good at all. It, it's, it's insane. I don't know what, who, what they were smoking when they decided that that's the standard that it should open in. But the fact that that happened, the fact that that literally is still a thing, they've never turned off. And they just haven't updated to turn off when you start the game. Crazy. Completely insane. That's a tank. That's a tank. this again? Oh, Katana. 
Do I care about Katana? Nah. Nah. Oh, that's two tanks. Well, I mean, where's the enemy team then? They've got two tanks pushed up here. They've got two tanks. Where are the enemies? Run into my mine? Could you? Or not? Or don't. That's fine, I guess. Does COD look better in HDR? I don't know. The, the game, no, but when you open it in HDR, it literally just breaks everything. The game is just broken when you open it. I don't think it actually works. I think it's broken. A cheer? Our first cheer? This guy, this is just flew across the map. Did you see that? Uh, is that is that normal? I don't know. I haven't played Battlefield 5 in a while. Do the, 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 the do the boats usually uh, fly in the air? Or is there some sort of bug I don't know about? Ow? What? Nice. Good to quick scope, bro. Come on, get him in the head. Go on. No. We can get him, dude. We have the technology. Just give us, give us the time. A little bit more. Oh, yes, dude. I got him. How am I spotted? Not the, not the plane flares. Did they never fix those? Yeah, let's make something impossible to destroy. Where do I aim? Where do I aim? Where do I aim? Where do I aim? Yo, what the hell? Wait, why, why is that? Why? What the hell was that? Why does it do that? Is this some new strategy I don't know about? What is that, guys? What is that? Oh, come on, he's back. They place the C4s on the back and yeet it. Oh, dude. It stops cheaters, but not pirates. That was crazy. But I mean, it didn't really do anything. They have to put it, they, only, they need to put it in a better spot. It's cool that people have found that though. Don't let, don't let DICE hear about it though. They'll delete it. I, I can't believe they removed the hovercraft um, meme. Do you remember, remember the hovercraft meme where you could fly up buildings? God, I miss good Battlefield games. Miss, damn it. Got him. He's back, he's back, he's back. Oh yeah, enemy boat spotted, enemy boat spotted, enemy boat spotted, enemy boat spotted. Oh, that was a nice shot, dude. I didn't even see him. I'm on autopilot with this gun. With auto aim. Come on, hit him. Yeah. Do you win? Do you win prone? I hear footsteps. Close. Oh no. Nice. Team is popping off, dude. Uh, what are these? Are these ours or theirs? I don't even know. What the hell was that? I don't know anymore.
Yeah, so this was the thing that always got me, the what they called, the um the healing, not back to full health. Why? After all, why? One health I have now, and I won't get it back. So GG's I guess. Two hits, god damn it, dude. He's gonna come around. We got two. I'm dead. Why do I only? I get no health now. You see what I mean? And this is why everyone played Battlefield 5 a bit more campy because what are you supposed to do? I, I can't get my health back. I'm one. I'm one. I'm one now forever. And then someone in the chat would always go, "Well, why don't you play with your team?" And I was like, and then I'd show that, and then I'd show the scoreboard and show that I had no medics on my team, and they'd be like. Well, that's a skill issue. Bye. Oh, by the way, one thing. So you one little piece of feedback. Um, you know how I was talking about the shroud thing earlier? The one piece of feedback they did take from me, they originally were not going to have the bandage mechanic in BF5, guys. I've talked about this a few times. Originally, there was going to be no bandage mechanic. There was going to be no bandage mechanic. You were going to run around with low health until you got healed. That is crazy. How crazy is that? And I, and I, um, and I, I, it was a tweet. It wasn't actually direct feedback. It was a tweet. I did a tweet saying, guys, could we possibly have like a bandage so that we can heal ourselves? Because this is crazy right now. Um, so originally, you were just going to run around with your squad and no, and it was going to be super hardcore. You just weren't going to have healing unless you got healed by a medic. Which is nuts, brother. You know? I wish we would have got the drag feature. Well, that's why I wanted them to switch to the, um, the original uh, reviving method from the old battlefields as well. I said, if we're not going to get the dragon mechanic, then can we have the original healing where you can charge up the... You can charge up the heal and just res people by pressing, by clicking the button on them when, when it was ready, you know? But they didn't change that. But some people say they prefer the BF5 method. Because it means that people can't just like chain res, right? I don't know. Imagine if you could just move the player a little bit, you know? Imagine if you could just move the player a little bit whilst reviving them. That would at least... Or at least control the angle at which you revive. You know what I mean? Like... Because I'm pretty sure right now it just kind of goes... Um, wherever it feels like. Like, oh, I want to res here. Okay, well, I'm going to put you... Because this is the only angle you can res, so here you go. You're in the line of fire now. Sorry. Whoopsie. Corpus, thank you for the 22 months. And Joe Red of Doom, thank you for the tier one. Did I miss that one? I think I did. Joe Red of Doom, thank you for the tier one, dude. Is he this side or this side? I don't know which way they went. They are that side. God damn it, dude. Oof. Get him, get him, get him. He's dodging. Jack and the Dalfi. Thank you very much for the, uh, what was it? Two months now. Thank you. I think I'm going to die. But we'll try and get some healing either way. Nice. That was nice. Uh, Jack and the Dalfi. Thank you for the two months, dude. We jumped, he jumped, he jumped. Uh, teammate tank? Is he going to shoot these guys in the back or...
He's cooking. Oh man, he was cooking. Where are they at? Enemy suppressed. Ugh. In any game, headshots should not be revivable. Whilst I, I kind of, like, I get it. Um, I think that's not very fun. What are they doing, dude? Boys, AT. Wow, that's the spot. That is certainly a spot. Is there an enemy right there? Oof. Oh, and the getting out of vehicle animation. That's just a thing. Where's the guy with the... Where's the boy's AT rifle guy? Is he still alive? He is. Did I see him? Is that someone right there? There is people. Only a tank headshot is not revived. Wait, that's a thing? If you get headshot by a tank, you can't be revived? That's so weird. That's so specific. I thought it was any headshot. Slow on the second shot, but I had no choice. Oh, yeah, I forgot you can, um, what's it called? Run, you can, um, crouch sprint, can't you, in this game? That's an angle. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, that would have been a cool shot, but I missed. Nice shot. Nice, Daniel. Nice shot, Daniel. Keeping them, I'm keeping them back. Is it throwing knife always a one shot? Whoa, one health. There's a guy pushing my butt, my car. I swear my my uh, pistol shot actually shot them. Should I kill them? Oof. 
That was nice, dude. He's back. He's coming back slowly. He's recovering from the aim assist wars of Warzone. Something else with Warzone is, is Warzone has a really weird input lag. It could just be the way the weapons sway, but I feel like I'm not I'm nowhere near as snappy at all. But some people are, seemingly. I think that's what I, I was getting kicked from the BOB servers, but I don't know why. And don't say because I'm cheating. But yeah, whenever I joined a BOB server, I'd get kicked after like three minutes or whatever. I don't think I was cheating, guys, but they seem to think I was. I might be on a list somewhere for the BOB servers. Simply not allowed. You can actually shoot through these slats, by the way, if you didn't know. You just gotta be very careful. That was a nice shot, dude. And I'm not even cheating. I hear footsteps behind me. No, if he didn't have a shotgun, I think I win that. Dude, that, that was that was some war zone level tracking on that guy. I hopefully dice go back to photogrammetry approach. Is why did they ever stop doing that? I'm sure they didn't. I'm sure 2042 probably has photogrammetry. It just doesn't look as good. Because it's turquoise! Everything's turquoise for some reason. And I don't know why. It's just a weird vibe. Listen, 2042 isn't perfect. You know, I ain't, I ain't stupid. I don't know. Hello? Mm. Oh, I well, you can get this guy. Hold on. Or not. I'm just going to get shot. Where's the tank guy? Where's the tank guy? Oh god. What Battlefield do I like the most? Uh, well, Battlefield 4 for me. But... Um, do I like BF1? I like Bad Company 2. Bad Company 2 had the best vibe, I think. Whether the mechanics were the best, probably not. The cheaters are gone. Uh, the cheaters aren't gone, but I've not seen any. Whereas usually I'd see like three a game and it would be unplayable. So, I don't know, man. Why well, am I not playing 2042? I did play 20. I played 2042 for the new update. If you guys saw. Battlefield used to be orange. It did. BF3, right? That was a nice shot, but I still died. To a guy that was prone in a bush. God damn it. Oh, did you... What, you think 2040... You do, do you think Battlefield 2042 was made for mobile? At what, run at 5 FPS? What was it? Is that what you think? Huh? Who just got- how did you just get sniped and it almost hit me? Have I found any cheaters so far? What? I guess there's supposed to be music there. That just felt so- I felt- that felt wrong. Uh, no, I- uh, no cheaters. So I guess the anti cheat's working. So far. Storyline node? What? 
What? Ah, uh, Iwo Jimi. Iwo Jimi. Am I on attack? Oh god. And again. That's gonna be pain. Uh, Car 98. We'll see how it goes. If we get stuck in spawn... I'm out. Uwu Jima. That's right. That month or two where the color filter could be removed in BF3 was peak. Well, why did they why did they change that? Why did they ever change that? Uh, oh, this is going to be rough. This is going to be rough. I... But look how good the graphics look, dude. Look at the waves. Secure all yeah. objectives in each sector, then push into the next. Brings a tear to your eye. <laughs> This is the way the battlefield should have been done. By the way, this was like such an insanely good update. The, uh, the Japan update. And then they were like, all right, we're done. That'll do. Thanks for playing, guys. Bye. Sniped in the head. When I get out of this boat. Let's see if we got anyone on the minimap. We don't have anyone right in front of us, but I think there's someone to the right. Come on, get him in the head, get him in the head. Yeah. Oh, I almost got the other guy too. Let's go! Push up the beach with no cover. Let's go! I heard. I just heard voices. Wait, did they never fix the fact that you can hear enemies' voices? They never fixed that because I just definitely heard someone about ten meters in front of me, like right here. Watch over there! Push together, dude. That's intended? No, no, I, re I remember it was a big problem because you can hear enemies shouting out um, and it gives away their position and it's really stupid. But hey, listen, I don't, you know, I didn't make it. That's not on me. I didn't make that decision. Oh, Jesus. There's a tank coming. That tank's coming, Thomas. I'm dead. Hang on. Well, that sucks. I thought he was just going to kill me instantly, so I just, like, kind of gave up. It was a bit like we were, gonna, we were about to throw our helmets at each other. I wish that... Dude, imagine if they had that in BF5. The, the full, uh, the full saving pro Bro, what are you doing? The full saving Private Ryan. Come on, he's one yeah. Now, you see, don't use your med kit at 75 health, because I will get full health regen without healing. So you just got to wait a little bit. 
You've got to be, uh, you actually have, you have to do quick maths whilst you play this game. For the, uh, healing mechanics. What? That was a heady, wasn't it? That's his head right there. Hello? We're shooting him in the face. Yeah, imagine if you could throw your pistol in your helmet. It does like 20 damage. That'd be so funny. Okay, maybe a bit high. I'm missing my shots, dude. I guess he's not back. No, he's back. He's back. That guy, he's dead already. I would have got that kill. Not cool. We've taken control of objective A. I guess I'll spawn in there. If this is hell, yeah. He's already dead. Bro, let me get a kill, man. Come on, brother. The problem is, is the enemy team is so hard. Actually, no, they're not hard to see. I'm lying. I'm talking about my team. My team is the one that blends into the environment way better. Oh my god, what was that? I did see a guy in that smoke. I'm just shooting just in case. See, they're going to be looking for army guys. Okay, bro. Unnecessary, but all right. Nice shot, nice shot, nice shot, nice shot, nice shot, nice shot. I used to watch Family Guy all the time. Probably my favorite show for like 10 years straight. But it got a bit silly, didn't it? It got a bit too silly. What's my graphics looking like? I don't know, pretty good. There is a guy there, but I can't see him probably. Real ones remember late night BBC Three Family Guy. Ten is it nine till ten PM or ten to eleven PM? It was two episodes, I think. Or was it? I can't remember. It was three episodes actually. Could have been three. That's what I went to sleep to on school nights. What? I swear that's a heady. And then American Dad, but I always fell asleep before American Dad, so I never got to watch it. So I, I have I have no knowledge of American Dad, but loads of knowledge of uh, Family Guy. Or maybe I'd watch like half an episode of American Dad and fall asleep. Cooking. He's cooking. I was perpetually tired at school because of those. Yeah. 
I was just perpetually tired at school, even if I did sleep. Oh, you've gone prone, sir. That's not the way. Definitely, what, what, that's not what you want. Oh, he's cooking, dude. Definitely cooking. We now control the sector. Good job. Clear the sector of all enemy combatants. I'm still tired today, yeah, from those Family Guy episodes 10 years ago. Wait, there's a guy behind me. The hell? I've always been tired. That's my secret. There are no further threats within the Where's sector. the sniper? Oh, shit. You know, it's nice to play a game where aiming matters. I say that. I mean, I'm literally sitting in the back of the map. And I don't really have to think too much. Listen, guys, I'm not, I'm not stupid. You know, I understand. You can enjoy Call of Duty on controller, but it's harder on Battlefield. And I bet you that changes in the next update. We're gonna be ruined. I was, uh, by the way, so I played, uh, I played Warzone Rebirth yesterday, and I was like, okay, I know it's gonna be sway, right? I know that. I'm not stupid. I know it's gonna be sway. Obviously, controller has a bit of an advantage, but like by a bit of an advantage, I thought, yeah, 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 they'll win a, few, they'll win like 80% of it. Like, brother, you, they can be 180 degrees facing the other way, turn around and kill you easily. And I, and I think that's really just, I, I mean, I'm pretty much done with the entire game for close range. Like the fact that I can, I can literally have first shot, have the, have an angle on them, shoot them in the back, and they can turn around and kill them before I, but I missed one bullet. And then, you know, people will say, lol, aim better or something, I don't know. Arctodus, thank you for the five gifted. Why don't I, I can't hear it though. Did that not make a sound? It should have. Arctodus, thank you very much for the five gifted subs. Thank you so much, dude. If you just got given a sub, make sure I think Arctodus in the truck. And spin it. Yeah, just spin it around for him. If you could. And then I and then I was like, okay, maybe I'm just bad. I'll watch a guy who's really good this morning. So I was on I was watching some sort of random stream. Exactly the same thing happened. And the and the other and the other guy didn't even know what he was doing. The guy that on controller was like looking the other way. The the other guy played it perfectly and then just gets one one frame when he, when the guy turns around. I was so mad. It's not just me. We have to remember there was no crossplay on BF5. I'm only facing mouse and keyboard players on, on this BF5. Oh, I'm gonna die. Actually, maybe I won't. I'll be okay. Wait, is there a prone dive in this game? Oh, there is. I forgot about that. It's like a, it's a weak prone dive, but it's a prone dive. You think, no, no, no. I think the new Battlefield's gonna get a juiced up controller. If it's still going to be crossplay or skill based matchmaking or insane aim assist, pick your poison. I'm telling you right now. That's what's happening. Skill based matchmaking or aim assist. I'm telling you. Both are terrible. Nice shot, dude. I saw the ammo come off him, so I knew he was dead. Counterpoint server. If they don't have a server browser in the next battlefield, oof. The players don't know anything. We know everything. Matchmaking better. By the way, uh, every time I've disconnected from a server in this game, 
every time I've disconnected from a server in this game, um, I've reconnected um, basically instantly. Uh, and that is the power of a server browser. Did that guy really just try and bayonet charge me? I think he did. Ow. I think I'm dead, though. I need to literally hit a headshot or I'm dead if he peeks me, which he's definitely going to do in about three, two, one. Where are you? Why are you not peeking? Where's this guy? I'm healing? He's let me... What is going on? Where's he gone? Is he dead? He just... He's still alive. I'm dead. Yes! Let's go! Gareth Morgan. Thank you for the 10, dude. Thank you so much. Uh, if you're liking the stream today, make sure to leave a like. If we get 1,000 likes, I'll tell you what. We'll do another Battlefield stream one day. Feisty. Thank you for the 27 months. And Gareth, thank you so much for the 10. Thank you. Where's this guy? Is he n oh, he's literally standing next to the objective. I'd never do that. Objective Baker is under attack. Hello? Oh, we're, we're already pushed through. Cool. It's a dead guy. Is there another guy? Are they all dead? Oh my god, guys. That's the other thing I forgot about the new 2042. You can't tell teammates and enemies apart by looking at them. I completely forgot about that. That was cra That was crazy of them. That was actually crazy of them. That you can't tell enemies and teammates apart in 2042, but you can in every other game. Oof. What from 2042 would I keep? Uh, nothing. No, I think um, the attachment system isn't too bad. You know, where you can change attachments. But they need to make it so you can't just cheese the ammo. I'd love to be able to change scopes or whatever. Which is sick, by the way. Um, but maybe not, like, change the entire gun mid-fight. I don't know. I feel like, yeah, that's kind of cool. But maybe just, like, the scopes or the, uh, the attachment system is cool. I was actually going to make a video called 10 Things Battlefield 2042 Did Right. But I didn't want to, um, I didn't want to get killed by the community, assassinated. You know, I was thinking, you know what? Maybe making a video about the 10 best things about 2042. I didn't get to 10. No. I also got to 8, I think. But that's not the point. The point is, is I think I may have been murdered. Or labeled the ultimate shill. But it was a new thing. Like, there are some good things about 2042. But is it worth the views, man? I don't know, dude. Is it worth risking my life for the next five years? As they hunt me down. <sighs> well, that's the thing, Pinch. Apparently, everyone else was getting paid to give feedback. Yeah, you saw that, right? You saw the, th the thing with... Sh you saw the thing with Shroud? A hundred people got paid to give feedback for, for 2042! A hundred people! A hundred! They must have lost my invite. I must have lost it in the post, dude. Oh, that was a nice shot. Then do a little cheeky lean. Oh, they're peeking. They're peeking. Throwing knife. Okay. I mean, I kind of deserve that. And you wouldn't believe how many of those people probably weren't Battlefield players. Because I don't know a lot of uh, people from the Battlefield community that were one of those 100 people. Like, I, I, I don't know anyone personally. So when we heard about this, we were like, hey, you could have ignored my feedback for free, dude. I just want, I just, I didn't even get to give feedback. That's what's crazy. I didn't even get to give feedback at all for 2042. I only got to give feedback for BF5. Uh, three months before launch.
Huh? Huh? Is he still there? I think he is. He did. Have some cash for BFR. Yo, wait. The community feedback. I'm, I'm getting paid for the community feedback. Jack and Natalfi, thank you for the 59. Have some cash for BF5. Thanks, dude. Um, oh, he's above us, look. Is he going to drop my head? He is, look. He's right there. Nice. Yo, thank you very much, Jack and Natalfi. Shroud might have been exaggerating a little. Yeah, of course. I'm, I'm also exaggerating, dude. Like, honestly... I have I've always given feedback for free. I think I've I don't think I've ever been paid to give feedback. Ever. Um I'm trying to think. If I've ever been paid to give feedback. I'm obviously not good enough at it. To be a consultant. Yeah, that that is the problem with Shroud's. I actually don't agree with Shroud's point of view. He actually wants Battlefield to become more of a tactical shooter. And I don't know, man. We've got we've got enough of those. Like, we've already got Hell Let Loose. Do you know what I mean? Hell not so loose. No. Where are these guys? Are they in the, they're in the caves. That's why. They're underneath us. I mean, this is this is my first ever BF5 YouTube stream, guys. Um, so the quality might be insane. It probably looks okay on Twitch, though. When are we getting AV1, bro? I thought that was his, I thought that was supposed to be like now. It's been like two months of testing quotations. I did hit him, but the throwing knife has a range now. Remember when the throwing knife used to be five and unlimited range? Yeah, no, the new Twitch quality isn't out yet. You don't have AV1 yet. You can, So right now you can, you can, what's it called? You can pick the things, but you don't get AV1. You just get HEBC or something or something. I can't remember what it is. But you don't have AV1 yet. under this cloud for a second. None? No one? The heck? Don't you worry, the V1s are coming. Although I'm not squad leader, am I? No, I'm not. So the other guys are gonna have to do it. God damn it, we're so far down. Oh, okay, this is, this is a good spawn, actually. Is he gonna peek? He's gonna peek over the top. But if we get the heady. You gonna peek? Or are you just gonna. Oh, what are you doing? Sir? He's too. He's too. 
Yes. Yes. Got him. Not a not tank, brother. We got a bit of a rough angle here. I can save my teammate. It's like Warzone all over again. No, I don't want to climb up here. What? That was a headshot. Oh, now we're screwed. Great. Thanks, game. I think it's a, uh, what's it called? Uh, invisible wall. Or a skill issue. Don't like this. Then there you go. It's horrible. Such a horrible angle to fire. You pushing? That was a heady as well. Huh? We don't have to run around, don't we? I can't get up this side. It's too, it's too easily defended. I didn't know they could sit up on the top side, to be honest. I missed completely. My bad. Here they come, dude! Yo! I wasn't as impressed as I thought. Can't see. Oh, nice shot. You got zero people. Yeah. It was the way it was meant to be. Nice, they did. Insane shots, insane. He's insane, he's insane, he's insane, he's insane. No, I don't like this. Not fun. Did I get my health regen? I did. At least got my health regen. Okay. Well, there goes all my health again. Cool. What mode do I like most in Battlefield? Rush and Breakthrough. I almost never play Conquest anymore. I just can't be asked with it. Why is aiming with snipers easier in BF5 than BF1? Because there's no suppression. Let's go! There's supposed to be music here, but I just turned it off, so I could be asked. Yay. Conquest was never good. Conquest is like very vehicle orientated for me. Like breakthrough is a little bit. I, I like the fact that the games are infantry based. But weirdly, strangely, I like that the games are infantry based most of the time. Bring out the Oh well, I'll see what next map is. Oh, it's the same map again. Ay, 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 ay. Do you know why they didn't continue content on this BF5? Probably because, um, remember, this was the first game with, without premium. So there would be no point because they wouldn't make any money on it. Pretty much. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm going to get disconnected from this server because I'm on, like, some sort of list or something. I'll be in there for, like, three minutes and then I'll get DC'd. I'm pretty sure these... I don't know why. They just don't like me. Who knows? Maybe it'll keep me in. M95. Did they have cosmetics in BF1? Um, No, they didn't. But they did have premium.
This is the first map they ever released. Do you guys remember that? Where is he? How has no one shot him yet? He's so low. He's not dead. Where is he? He's in this he's in this building apparently. Where is he? He's upstairs. What the heck? What? What? Makes no sense. They're not even in there, right? None of that made any sense. Okay, this is the beta map. I actually think this wasn't the greatest beta map, but that's on me. Hit him, but no heady. Damn it. Hit him again. I can only hit headshots, otherwise there's no damage. Yeah, I guess I guess graphically this map was the best uh, the best looking map probably. I guess. Okay. Alright. Oh, I guess I'll take the shots then. Where are these guys shooting me from? Hello? Dude. I don't understand. I can't see anyone. It's getting shot out of nowhere. Dead. Enemies. Can't see them. God, this is annoying. They're on the edge of the map on the cliffs. I know, I can't see them. Is that guy? The guy behind this? God damn it, dude. Just too much smoke. Oh, there's a tank. Of course there is. There's an enemy tank on the hill. No, there's a guy behind us! How does this keep happening? That guy. No, where is he? I'm losing my mind here. He's here. Can someone else help me with this guy, please? What is... How... How am I the only person that these people are finding? There's a heal. Where is it? Uh... Oh, it's not built. How do I build it again? Let me just rebuild the healing. Okay. There's a tank on me again. Any upcoming shooters I'm looking forward to? Uh, I mean, Delta Force, uh, Grey Zone Warfare. Uh, I guess Arc Raiders a little bit. I don't know. We'll see. It's not really a... Well, I guess it is a shooter. The PUBG one will be interesting for sure. I think the PUBG one will be interesting, but I'm still not sure about it. Oh my god, dude. How many smokes these people have? I'm just getting smoked off every five seconds. Any man? Okay, being shot from the right. Can they peek whilst I'm looking one time? That's a tank again. I'm actually... Where, where? There's a whole enemy team somewhere, allegedly. This is what I always think. How many people? 30 people. Where are they? Damn. Marathon? Marathon's not for ages, dude. And also, they just announced that it's going to be a hero shooter. I don't know. Not, not the wisest thing. I can't be asked with this map. This is actually... Boring. The problem is, if your team is too good at defending, then nothing actually happens. And I always talk about this. There's no point staying in a game where you're, like, winning by too much, because otherwise nothing happens.
Ooh, Aerodrome. Oh my god. Although it just switched to Hamada. Mm. Is Division Heartland going to be th uh, 3 PP only? Um, maybe. Not sure. I'll have to just wait in this queue then, I guess. Oh. I don't know why they called the game Marathon. Isn't Ma Marathon is based off a game that they brought out years ago, isn't it? Oh, hey, cat. Look on here. Mm. I'm in a queue of five. Fantastic. Marathon was some FPS game from Doom 1 on a Macintosh. Well, there you go. Do I like the finals? I liked the finals. I get again, again. I gave them some free feedback and I said, hey guys, I really enjoy the finals. But would you mind having some casual modes? Like, I don't know, like Team Fortress 2 has, like uh, Payload or um, Control Point. And they were like, no. And I was like, okay. Like, yeah, I get. I guess the competitive modes are fun and all, but they're all competitive. Why don't we have some party games like 6v6? And they were just like, nah. And I was like, okay. Dude, you're making so much fucking mess. But if you sit on my lap, then I won't be standing. There's hair everywhere, man. And that was the final say of that. Yes. No, you can only play 3v3v3 Sweatfest. Exactly. That's the problem I had. I was like, guys, guys, please. There is a huge audience of FPS players that want to play games for fun sometimes. Can we please can we please have some games that maybe uh, we're allowed to play for fun? Is that allowed? Is that okay? I'm I'm losing my mind out here. Every game. Skill based matchmaking, competitive only. And you're just like, no, why, why don't we make some fun games? Yes, but that's what I'm saying. Quick play 3v3v3v3 is still the competitive mode. Which still has school waste matchmaking. It's driving me insane. How many times do people need to say, Hi, why don't we have a game which is a bit more just kind of like casual and fun with larger teams? Because even if there is obviously really good players and there's less skill based matchmaking, right? So obviously, yeah, one player might be really good. But if there's like a mix of players, 6v6, larger teams. Oh my God, I can't. I can't do it. I don't know, guys. Maybe we should uh, market a game towards being able to play with your friends for fun. I don't know, man. I'm still waiting for the uh, for the game to let me in, and it's a map I like, so I'm just waiting for it. Have I ever tried VR? Yes, I did VR streams back in the day. The problem with VR is that it's funner to play VR than it is to watch it and not feel motion sick. Was Battlebit kind of like that? Yes, Battlebit was exactly that. Battlefield. Battlefield is still the same. In, in the regards to that. Like, you can still have fun on Battlefield because it is just a mix of teams with completely... Ar ra I have a cat on my lap now, by the way. And so if I miss, it's on the cat. All right. Because I'm having to lean forward so I don't crush her. Snipers? Snipers? Huh? Squish that cat. Oh. I still don't know where I just got sniped from. What? We are losing objective Anton. Huh? Oh he died. Hang on. Let me see. Wow. Okay, she's gone. It's game time. Nice shot. Nice shot. Nice shot. Nice shot. Nice shot. Nice shot. Nice 
Who's the sniping fun, guys? For me. Oh, he's one-y. He's got to be actually one health. What? They're still healing? Ah! How do they just take two or three or three hits? I don't know, man. I thought that was my teammate. That is my teammate. They're sitting next to each other. They're literally right next to each other. They're literally right next to each other. Oh my god. Why? <sighs> Insane. Insanity. Oh, come on. Move! Teammate! Blocking me, dude. Idiot. Idiot sandwich. Let's go! I still hit him. This game looks more fun than 2042. In some regards, but in some regards not. You know, it swings and roundabouts. The retreat was successful. Ugh. The snap. Let's see his arm. Hello? I don't have smoke grenades. I should have taken them. Hit him in the head. People still do fun modes on Battlefield 4? Yes. There's the, still the 128 player insane modes that they've built, which are fun. Matt. Oh my god, I missed my millimeters. Is he dead? He must be. I see something. No, are they, are they dead? Oh! Hit him in the head! Hit him in the head! How's the stream going? No cheaters so far. No cheaters yet. Yeah. One other trucker. That was a nice shot, but no heady. They actually got shot. No way. <sighs> no scope, Glint. Okay.
Medic? Let's go. Usually you can see the scope glint if they're gonna shoot me like that. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. That was a fun one. Wait, I can just keep you in a ride, okay? Yeah, you're actually dog. Huh? What the? I was gonna say, where are these people shooting from? And how have they not been shot by my teammates already? Medic's actually doing their job there. I know, it's crazy. That is crazy. People don't really medic in um, battlefields anymore. Like 2042, I swear. No one really re like tries to revive. Thanks, I guess. Oh yeah, they removed the ability to, to break down walls and stuff in um, in BF5, which was dumb. Like the wires and shit. Remember the wires that you could break in BF1? Depending on what weapon you had? If I get sniped, if I get sniped again by another sniper, I can't see. I'm gonna be annoyed. That's just facts. I live for the medic role. That's what I'm saying. But I swear, 2042 just doesn't really have that culture of giving a crap about your teammates. I don't know. Or the rewards for reviving were just like nothing, so no one cares. It's literally just kids like, who cares, dude? Whoa, that's a good nade. I remember I can I can throw them away, can't I? I just forget that you can do that. Okay, the ground shakes a bit much. Okay, there is 32 players somewhere in this map. And they're right behind me making no sound. Twenty forty two is too sweaty? I don't know about me sweaty. I think we're gonna get pummeled in the corner here. Anyone? Where is everyone? There's just tanks looking into a big open empty shell with no cover. We've got nowhere to go. They're just sniping. I can't see them though. Can't peek anywhere. Not allowed. Okay, get him in the face. I definitely need nades. Look at this guy. That's what I thought. gonna suck. Oh, we're dead. Doink. See you later, Pinch. Isn't the idea of a sniper not to be seen? Well, they're doing a great job. Clearly. Clearly, they've done a great job. Another one? That didn't kill anyone, what the hell? I 
thought I was going to kill at least one of them. Ah, Jesus. Wait, we lost? We won! Okay. Twenty forty two sweatier than the last two BFs. Isn't that because of the crossplay though? Because usually you only play uh, console versus console, um, PC versus PC. Well, now it's like crossplay, so you're placing a lot more PC players. <laughs> I think. Anyway, one thing I've always thought about is like the difference between facing controller players on console versus controller players on PC is literally night and day as well. I don't know what that the deal is with that on Warzone. And I feel like the disparity between console controller on console and controller on PC against each other is also insane. Iwo Jima again, dude? I don't know if I can do that again. Would you prefer the next BF game to have soldiers instead of heroes? Obviously, yes. I want to be able to tell that this person is on this team and this person on this team by without a marker over their head. Oh, he's wearing the gray outfit. That means he's on that team. Oh, they're wearing the blue outfit. That means they're on this team. Do you know what I mean? Like the fact that I have to look up players on 2042 wearing a bright red outfit and be like, that's my teammate. And then I get shot in the head. I, I get so triggered. It's ridiculous that we have to... That you that we're having to do that. It's just so stupid. Same thing with Warzone in it. Yeah, but thing the thing is with Warzone is is you're you're never really in a big team, right? And even in the multiplayer, they purposefully have two different sides. But regardless, they have insane UI elements to 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 know which is your enemy team and which isn't. They have big red um, nameplates. Which I never noticed before. It's really weird. When you think about when you play Call of Duty games, you never think, you never in your head imagine the nameplates being there. And then you go and play them. You're like, oh my god, there's nameplates everywhere. Um, whereas in Battlefield, they do have the nameplates now, but they didn't when it first launched. Now there's nameplates, like, uh, that's like a feature of the game. You have nameplates when you aim at someone. I'm trying to get into a one last, one last game. So what's new with the update? They've added anti-cheat to Battlefield 5. So I did a video, and in fact, I might link you the video in the description or whatever. I'll link it to you. There is a video on my YouTube channel called Why I Don't Play Battlefield Anymore. And essentially, um, Battlefield... Five and Battlefield One have um, so many cheaters that you essentially just can't stream it, right? So I w you can play it offline. But if you go live and there's stream there's cheaters watching it, they'll often just come and just ruin your games. So I literally had to stop streaming um, Battlefield One and Battlefield Five. Now there is anti cheat, but whether that's um, solved the issue, if you remember, there was an IP resolver for BF Five. I'll talk about it later, but there was an IP resolver for BF5. Maybe maybe BF1 as well. Um, which means... Um, yeah, you need to be hiding your IP when you play these games. Oh my god, Jesus. Uh, if you're streaming. But the whole the whole thing is is I don't think there was an anti cheat on BF5 that was working properly until literally yesterday. Now I don't know if it's working. No, get down. I don't know if it's working yet, but if if it isn't working, I guess people are still less inclined to cheat if they think they're going to turn it on at any point. So they've installed it in the game, they haven't turned it on yet, but I've seen not a single cheater today. Uh, okay. This is one of the the this is the last map that was added, right? This one. 
And so I've basically just come back to play and been like, hey, I can finally play again. Essentially. I like the uh, lean feature in BF5 as well. I thought that was really cool. I'm sad that they uh, got rid of it. Am I going to get beamed from my left? What? That was my kill. No, no, no. That was so annoying. I forgot how unsmooth the um, the climbing animation was in this game. Horrendous. Takes forever. You see cat, you like video. Good, good, good. Keep that going. How many times can I bring the cat in? Before I get diminishing returns. certain that announcing the release of an anti-cheat is shooting yourself in the foot. Oh yeah, for sure. But it means I make content. I mean, the likelihood of me streaming Battlefield 5 without this announcement was pretty damn low. Oh, come on. I was going with the mid-air. Kind of screwed here now. That's a long reload. Holy shit! Just smoke that off. Ah! Oh, missed the heady by millimeters. Don't really have anything to do with the guys up top. What? This guy's behind me. Who just shot me in the back? Can I get up here? Ugh. It's so slow. Look how slow I am running up here. Horrendous. Holy crap. Ooh, that was a nasty hip fire shot. I got an assist gun's kill for that. Oh, the last two shots. Let's go. That was pretty nasty. Oh, I missed the headies a little bit there. shots mm, I don't have throwing knives and I think my brain is telling me I do which is confusing me let's put a five in we got healing where's the enemy is that can't heal him there you go Enemies? Where are they at? Where are they? I wish Bad, Bad Company 2 was alive. Didn't they shut, yeah, they shut down the servers recently, didn't they? Bad Company 2? Oof. Come on, teammates. Shoot, 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 shoot. He's low, he's low, he's low. Team, he's running through you. Stop. 
They're gone forever. That's a shame, man. I don't think I should res this guy. Boink. Danka. Whoa. Look at Project Roam for BC2. I'm guessing that's bringing the servers back then. Wait, wasn't there... Have you guys seen the, the, the release of... Or the the news of a mod launcher for Bad Company... Um, Battlefront 2, Star Wars. I swear, every time that happens, it always gets cancelled because someone just goes, no. Oh, dude, that would be sick if I hit the heady. Kaiba V2. Yeah. But was Venice Unleashed not shut down or did they let, did they let it keep going? I don't know. Star Wars Battlefront 2 mod launcher. Yes. As, as I said, these things always get shut down by the developers because it's simply not allowed. Even if it's free. But did, did Venice Unleashed get? I don't know. I literally have no idea. Ooh, yeah. Free is. I'm guessing it didn't, because otherwise they would have stopped. I'm going to get bloody moored. Holy. Okay. That's enough slices. They've been given the green light for it? No way. Jesus. We're blowing up. They blowed this BF with lots of animations? Yeah. What did they say? They wanted more visceral animations or something. I can't remember. It was something like that. More visceral gameplay. We're back. Where is this guy sniping me from? I can't even see. That's a, that's a shotgun. No, I missed one shot. Why well, only had one shot? That's the chance I had. How do people throw artillery? Uh, using this squad thing. You can still play Venice Unleashed. Oh. How many bloody artilleries do they have? Granate. That was a shot, dude. We won? Hell yeah, dude. Would love them to continue adding content to BF5. No, they won't. <laughs> that those days, well, they should have and they could have, but they but they won't have, and they wouldn't have, and it's over now. So GGs. Any cheaters so far? Nope. No cheaters so far, and you know what? We had a good time. I had great fun. But the thing is, as I said, 
How many hours do I have in this game? Let me have a check. I have... Hold on. Hold. I have... Um, I, 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 it's actually quicker to own F4 out of this game, isn't it? I forgot about this. Exiting animation. I have... 1,200... Well, actually, 1,120 hours, but I think I have it on something else as well. The beta I had, like, 100 hours on as well. So, like, 1,200 hours. I didn't want to play any more of it, that's for sure. Right, chat. How many hours do I have in Battlefield 2042? Go. Closest answer gets five large cookies. How many hours do I have in 2042? Oh, someone was pretty close there. Someone was very close there. Now, the closest... Well, that's the thing. The closest answer I think we got, if my math is correct. I'm just checking now. Checking the numbers. I'm checking the numbers now. With my trousers down. Okay, someone was even closer then. All right. It's 559 hours, and V Shall Sing guessed 550. Shaken One guessed 535, which was pretty close. But yeah, someone just guessed 550. Um, so yeah, I've pl I've played half the amount of hours in 2042 than BF5. Um, and then I played even more on BF1. How many on BF1? Let me have a look. Okay, BF1. You said 535. Yeah, no, so someone, uh, Vishal said 550. That's right. You were closest. What about Battlefield? Okay, okay, we'll do this then. What about BF1? How many hours? Oh, it's so precise. Okay, so people are going a bit insane now. No, I didn't do that many. I've gone mad. Oh, someone was very close then. Someone was very close then. All right, okay. The, well, the closest person this time, even though you were memeing, was Parasanic with 30, 1337. 1300 hours. Now, the, now the most difficult, which I literally, I think I've said this recently, so, uh, where is it? Battlefield 4. Wait, what? It doesn't tell me how many hours I have in BF4. I have, okay. I thought it did. I know how many hours I have in uh, Battlefield 4. Roughly. Two thousand mm. Origin did. EA app forgot all that. Yeah, thanks. Thanks, EA app. But EA app has it on my other ones. This doesn't make any sense. Anyway. The closest I believe where were they? I think it's two th two thousand six hundred. Which was someone said it. Where was it? Two thousand six hundred. Someone said two thousand six hundred, I think. I think Bar Hoppers was the closest. I think I said it recently in a in a stream. Anyway, that wasn't that fun. You guys win big. Um, now, if you guys uh, enjoyed the Battlefield streams today, make sure you like. Uh, make sure you're following. Obviously, you probably. I mean, to be honest, the only people watching Battlefield streams are people who already follow. Let's let's be real here. No one's going out of their way to find a Battlefield by stream. But 
Um, if you did enjoy the BF live stream today, um, make sure you're following. Leave a like. If we get a thousand, I'll probably do another one. Why not? That's 108 days. It is indeed, Jack. But I also did. I did four. I did no. I did like six 24-hour streams of BF4. I play BF4 a lot. Eight to ten to fourteen-hour streams every, almost every single day. Not anymore. Those days are over forever. And then BF3, I only had 400 hours, which is shocking. 400 hours in BF3. Disgusting. Almost, almost uh, abysmal. I loved every stream. Well, I'm glad you do. Anyway, uh, tomorrow, I'm either doing DMZ. Actually, I think I will do DMZ tomorrow. Um, and then, what's it called? DMZ and... Um, Helldivers on the weekend. We, we, we are now a variety streamer, guys. I don't know if you've noticed. I've become a variety streamer now. So, DMZ tomorrow. Helldivers 2 on the weekend. And then more DMZ next week. More Helldivers next week. And I doubt any more... War, war, I was saying, yesterday might have been the last Warzone stream. After that her ludicrous display. The knife throw. Oh, the knife throw, dude. Yeah, that was pretty good. What well, got updated? BF5. Yeah, they added anti-cheat, so I can actually stream it, potentially. Um, anyways, thank you guys very much for watching. I will... Uh, yeah, you got, go and say hello to Westy for me. If he's still alive. I think he is. Westy will still be going. Go and say hello to Westy and be like, Hey, hey, stud, hey. hey. But you can, you can be as annoying as you like. All right? Um, but yeah. See you guys in a bit. Now, for Team Purple, what a special surprise we have for you today. Now, 